Another way of controlling my opponent's upper body and uh, arms when in a position for the knee lever comes from uh, nogi situations. So now I want to get two on one control. So I'm going to just focus on the outside arm. I'm not going to, I'm not going to take any kind of control on my opponent's sleeve or outside collar. So whenever I'm able to grab two on one grip on his forearm, I want to slide my leg down, pinch, and I'm going to perform exactly the same move as I did before. So I raise up my bottom leg and as I'm finishing that quarters, quarter circle with my knee, I want to put my hips in to bridge. All right. So very easy to transform from, uh, from gi to no gi. I need to grab two on one. Whenever I grab two on one, I want to put my thumbs inside to make that, uh, that grip very hard to break. So whenever, whenever I get that, I like when my opponent is actually focusing on freeing that arm. So he's trying to free that arm, working with his, with his other hand. That gives me a little bit of time and a little bit of freedom because he's not really trying to get to my collar or uh, trying to get closer here. So then when he's fighting to break that grip, I got a little bit of time to finish my knee lever. So everything uh, when it comes to leg work stays the same. The only, the only difference is uh, the control of my opponent's arm.